Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's look at the problem 28 in chapter 6. In this one, things get a little bit difficult. It tells us we have two space shuttles do the circular motion around the Earth with a different uh, altitude. You can consider this as the distance above the Earth's surface. So this is 2h. Agree? h1 and h2. Do you agree? So in this one, when we consider the circular motion, and then what, what's next? We should consider the radius for the circular motion. In this one, we can see for the radius, it must include two parts. The radius of the earth and plus this altitude, right? altitude, the distance above the surface. So it should include these two parts. Now we just consider the first one model. And it, it asks you which uh, this uh, space shuttle is faster and by what factor. So faster means you need to compare its speed. Do you agree? So we need to find the speed for this circular motion. And for the circular motion, we can say the central force is just come from the gravity, gravitational force. This, this one, right? And it must equal to mass times the central acceleration. Agree? So this gravi gravitation uh, force G capital M small m r squared uh, equals to the mass times the central acceleration. In this equation, we can get the velocity. Uh, it's very easy. Squared G M divided by R, and this R just equal to this is E. Okay, sorry, E, and the E plus H. Now we need to compare these two velocities. So that means the V one equals to this one. V2 equals to this term, and then we need to find this ratio right, by what factor, so ratio. So V1 divided by V2 must equal to this equation. And in this equation, you can see the radius for the R is given, and this two uh, distance above the R, H1, H2 is also given. So very easily, you can find the velocity. And you can see, after you input the numbers inside, sorry, you input the numbers inside, you find it is 1.37. What that mean? That means for the closer, it is moves faster. It is very easy to understand because for the closer, for example, the H2 is closer, right? Or H1 is closer. So H1 is closer. You can see the H1 uh, is uh, small, smaller than H2. So the ratio H2 divided by H1 must be larger than 1. So that means the closer, the faster. Thank you.